Good morning everybody, this is Kevin and today is Monday the 28th of September 2020. I hope you're well, I hope you had a great, great weekend. Um, this is our morning daily meditation uh, to start the week, start the day, start everything. Um, as usual, I am going to continue my um, decision to um, work with Wisdom of the Hidden Realms deck. Um, feels like it, um, yeah, feels good and positive. Today's card that I drew is the word Lord. And the word Lord is about communication, praise. It's also about dishonesty. Speaking words that are positive, affirming all that is good, is honest. Chasing away words that hurt words that harm is the dishonest part so everything we put out with the energy of the word lord if it's doesn't matter if it's positive or negative it will manifest and come back <clears throat> all that we give praise for all that we affirm and align with that's all good with the world grateful with the world grateful with our lives, grateful for even things we complain about, comes back and manifests the way we want it to be. So when the word Lord shows up, it's a reminder to realign ourselves with all that's good, realign ourselves with all that's positive, and know that whatever we're projecting out, so if we're projecting love out, projecting abundance out, giving thanks for services we received and um, gratitude for money that we're getting, that will continue to come back. So for right now, we're going to meditate. So take a stretch up and as usual, pull your arms out wide. You can stretch your fingers if you want, just give you the little webbing inside every finger, a little bit of a stretch. Then pull your arms back. So you open up your chest, your upper back, that part of our body that's right below the neck, and even the neck for that matter. Um, give it a bit of a shift. Uh, oftentimes when we are sleeping and resting, the body goes into such a deep vibrational state that the physical body just sort of kind of lays dormant um, any undue left energy from previous day, hours, um, gets can get trapped, can get stuck. Um, so these movements, these physical movements, why yoga is so good with meditation and inquiry, because it gets into some of that fascia and removes some of the um, trapped stuff. All right, so now that we're stretched, bring your palms so they face your heart opening you can also if it makes you feel good to affirm something good um bring your left hand on top of your heart muscle your right hand can be resting on your belly if you want it to or straight over the top if this feels comfortable to you it does to me if it feels loving and kind and giving to you which it does to me then you know follow along there's no um no right or wrong with meditation it's the um, gift you give yourself. It's a gift you give your soul. It's a gift you give your spirit. And it's a gift you give the world. Right, so drop in. Close your eyes. Big breath in. Release out. Find the rhythm and the count of your breath. Inhale. Exhale. Just like that. Now bring your mind to the soles of your feet and open up. Mentally, the soles of your feet and just drain out, drip out, flow out all the 
negative energy that might be left there, judgment, complaint, frustration, the dis-ease, and dis-ease can be emotional, can be mental, and can actually be physical if you have headaches, earaches, toothaches, arthritis, joint issues, low back issues, feel lethargic, energy issues, let all of that gather and flow down and out the soles of your feet into the gracious love of the Mother Earth. Just pick a part of your body on the inside, a joint perhaps, a bone perhaps. Gather up the darkness and negativity, the toughness, the stuckness. And just as you would draining out a sink, just drain it out, down through your feet, into the earth. And use the love of the Mother Earth to quickly recycle all of that energy Feel it coming back to you. As if it's coming up and over from the heavens itself, down through the center of the top of your head, filling up from the bottom up, filling up from your feet, filling up to your knees, and then filling up quickly into your hips. And as it fills up with this clean, vibrant energy, Begin to feel the bubbles of effervescence, the bubbles of joy and happiness, the bubbles of abundance, prosperity. Let all that's good with you fill up. Keep filling up so every part of your physical being is full of love, full of positive energy, full of positive affirmations. As you get to the very top of your head and it's still gushing and flowing, allow the overflow of love and abundance and prosperity and positivity, gratitude, let all of that energy just flood and flow like a fountain. All the way down the outside of your body, just showering you with all the goodness, the brightness. Allow the small micro droplets to bounce off the outside of your body. Let all of the micro droplets expand out, filling up the area that you're around. Imagine these micro droplets getting smaller and smaller till they become a delicate soft mist. Know that the inside of your body is filled with positive light. Positive energy, bright energy, loving energy, kind energy. There is no room for the opposite. There's no room for fear-based energy. Only love-based energy is present. can also picture, smell, 
Whatever love-based fragrance you want to smell could be lavender roses. A fragrance that works for you, a fragrance that aligns with you. It could be a fragrance of the ocean or the fragrance of the forest. The fragrance of a mountain of crisp morning, just bring in beautiful fragrance, send it out from you. These are gifts, gifts from your heavenly fathers, your archangels. All your divine mothers are bringing you gifts right now. Gifts that they willingly share with you. Just allow yourself to breathe in into an outward all that lifts you, all that positively inspires you, all that gratefully empowers you. May this energy be extended beyond your body to create the most perfect aura. Give humble thanks and gratitude to all your archangels, higher ones, the spirit world and the universe for all the gifts that have been bestowed upon you. We thank you angels and archangels for showing us what we need to know and bringing us what we need to use. Thank you for the miracles of transformation, affirmation, manifestation. Thanks for the gift of good health. Thanks for the gift of abundant wealth. Thanks for the givenness of unlimited opportunity for the highest good of everybody on the planet and beyond. And so it is. Bring your hands to heart centre. Acknowledge everything you've just affirmed. Lift your thumb knuckles up between the eyebrows. Just gently bow forward. Namaste. Very simple, very easy. And um, I'm grateful to all of you for tuning in and coming. It's a short one this morning, but it brings in everything that the Word Lord talks about to remind us that life, the world, doesn't have to be so negative, so dark. We don't have to walk around feeling hard done by or attacked or put upon. Everything that we are and everything we do has a choice. There's a choice between positive, choice between negative, and that's the beautiful thing about being a soul inside a body with the spirit to align with whatever we want to align with. It's been a pleasure talking with you this morning and coming to you. Um, I hope if you're finding this on YouTube that you will do me a favor, like and subscribe and um, share it. All right. Have a great Monday and we will talk to each other, see each other, connect with each other tomorrow. Bye.